Before. But as far as the temperature trends have gone, we have been running above average. We did have a front early last week, gave us two days, only two days of below normal temperatures. And that 65 last uh, Tuesday and Wednesday was only a degree below average. And then right away, we're back into the 80s, which is where we were by Saturday. Yesterday had a front move through late Saturday, kept our temperatures in the 50s, then another quick warm up by Monday. So why are we not getting these cold air masses to last? for very long. Well, here's what's going on. We already have a warming trend across the central United States. The colder air is up to the north. The coldest of the air is bottled up into Canada and northern uh, Alaska and northern Canada. And we have really not yet this season seen that cold air move very far south. We would need to see is a deep upper trough, which would allow for that colder air to move on in. And that just has not really happened this season. We have a westerly flow aloft that usually kind of cuts off the colder air and allows for our temperatures to begin warming up. So what we would need is a deep upper trough that brings in that cold Arctic air to the Midwest parts of the plains, the Ohio Valley. That colder air is able to make it down to the southeast, and that usually means we get cold and we stay cold. But that has not been the pattern that we have seen this season. What we have seen is more shallow upper troughs. They're not digging deep very far south. So the cold air generally stays to our north. We get chilly or cool, but that usually doesn't last for very long. When we get a westerly flow aloft, it doesn't take much down along the Gulf South to get that cold air to retreat back northward, and then we start warming up. So we still get cold fronts. They just don't last for very long, and they're not very, very cold. And that's what we have seen, and that is very typical in a La Nina winter. And that looks like what we may continue with the trend uh, for the rest of this winter, going into January, February, and into March.